So to make the choker, you need to chain in multiples of four. So I have done a chain of 16 and then you need to add nine. Now what you need to do is make sure Hold on, let me just count, so that's my nine added. Um, to get it the right size, just keep trying it around your neck um, and make sure that you add a little bit extra um, so that you can tie it at the back, okay? Um, you don't want it to be completely, um, you know, you want it to be a tight fit, obviously, because it's going to be sitting around your neck, um, but you want it to, um, you want to be able to tie it on. Okay, so just leave a little bit, a little bit of extra. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to do a double crochet in the ninth chain from the hook. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's this guy here. Let me do a double crochet. Okay, so put a little loop and then we chain five. miss three, three, and then do a double crochet in the next one. Okay, so now you've got two loops, so you just do that all the way to the end. So chain five, miss three, and a double crochet. I think there's a chilly hair in that bit there. It's because my ball of yarn keeps rolling onto the floor. Chain five, miss three, and double crochet. Miss three and double crochet. So you should end up with your last double crochet in your last chain. So that's the first row of your choker. Really easy. Now what we're going to do is chain five. Okay. And then we're going to work a slip stitch into the third chain from the hook. So one, two, three, we're going to slip the yarn through to create a little pico. And then we're going to turn chain three and work a double crochet into this first loop. Okay, and then chain five again. One, two, five. Slip stitch into the third chain from the hook. Chain three, and then double crochet into the loop. Okay, so what you're getting is a little pico there. You can't see just yet how effective it is. One, two, three, four, five. And obviously it looks ginormous because I'm using um, DK weight yarn. Um, that's not to say that DK weight yarn wouldn't make a good choker but I just think that the finer the yarn that you can use the more delicate it's going to look two, three, four, five oops, one, two, th hold on, one, two, three, four. he's got a little bit squished up there 
and I've got another chilli hair. Crochet. Let's get rid of that chilli hair. Last one. Slip stitch into the third, chain three, and double crochet into your last loop. And that is that. What you get, if I take away the dog hairs, is a perfect choker design. So you would wear it that way round and have your little picos sitting at the bottom. I love this. Love this idea. I hope you do too. I hope that was useful. And um, thanks for watching. Bye. See you on the next video.